I told these domestic ass, toxic ass, low vibrational ass bitches to stop with all that goddamn steel work, Chad. They don't fucking listen, y'all. These hoes didn't watch their mamas and grannies and every fucking body out here doing fucking spell work. Thinking they got some fucking superpowers, child. Goddamn it. When we, it's been, it been forbidden in the Bible. It been forbidden in the Bible. Told you little motherfucking witches to stop all that goddamn spell work. Casting spells on motherfuckers. So what they do? They taught you motherfuckers English. So that way, goddamn it, yeah, you cast spells on each other by your damn self. Because we know that the power is in your tongue. You're going to either bring life to a motherfucker or you're going to bring death to a motherfucker. And lots of times these motherfuckers is out here, goddamn it, casting spells on motherfuckers that they don't even fucking know it. Why? Because they don't know their fucking history. They slow. These dumb demonic motherfuckers then sat around Grouped up, y'all. I'm trying to tell y'all. These motherfuckers then voodoo bitches. I'm talking about these little motherfucking devil pussy hoes. Then got together, y'all. Casting spells after spell. I'm talking about even motherfucking paid for spell work. You know that goddamn it. You a demonic hoe. If you went out your way. Paying for spell work. And then what kills me about these little secret motherfucking bitches is because they secretly doing the shit. Why? Because they don't want you to know that they a fucking devil. They want to sit back and plot. You know, these hoes is scary. But they act like they fucking goddamn it. They want you to be scared of them. But how the fuck could I be scared of a bitch that's out here doing shit behind people back? See what I'm saying? See, I don't know what y'all bitches is confused. You want me to believe that you a tough bitch, but you doing shit behind people back. You talk about bitches behind people back. You would never say that shit to a bitch face. So I'm just sorry. If you hoes ain't so tough, you bitches ain't that tough to me. If you don't know how to take that same energy and say that shit to the motherfucker that you're talking about. Take that same energy, that same negative ass energy that your ass conjuring up. Yeah. Go do that shit to the bitch. Goddamn it in her face. Nine time out of ten, these hoes not doing that. They cast the spells behind people back. They doing black magic, and then they sit back and try to act like they innocent and be like, oh, see, I told you she was like this. I told you she was like that. No, I'm not like nothing, motherfucker. What's going on is you voodoo bitches thought you was motherfuckers controlling me. But I just want you hoes to understand, you bitches, how the fuck could you control me? You motherfuckers is trying to stop me. But you're not understanding. When I'm working with the power of God, you bitches can never stop me. So I, I don't know what you're going to do. Every fucking moon cycle, these hoes conjuring up demons. That's why I got on their ass and now, God damn it, I got shit dropping all the way to the end of the year. Now what these hoes going to do? I fucked up their plans, y'all. See, they was planning on doing spell after spell, Christmas time, spell after spell, every moon cycle, spell after spell. They even pay for the shit to the point where, God damn, motherfucker, you went broke. You went broke. You didn't put your money in investments. No. And then getting, got nerd. These hoes getting mad at me. Why? Because I'm putting my money in investments. I'm not sitting around gossiping about you hoes. I don't give a fuck about none of you bitches. You bitches can't sit with me because you sit around talking about another bitch while I sit here and figure out how to make a way out of no motherfucking way. That's God right there, child. That's when you know you a real creator. When you sitting around developing your own path, you in your own lane, and these bitches can't take it. Why? Because you remind these hoes a change that these hoes don't want to fucking make. No, these hoes love using that nigga money. No, these hoes love... God damn it, thinking they better than some fucking body because they got a nigga. No, bitch, you with a nigga and you have to force that shit. Uh-uh. When I get married and I have my nigga, it's going to be because we want to be together. It's going to be because, God damn it, that's what God said it is. It's going to be because we carrying out a mission. That's the whole reason why we together. So I know you bitches then got lost and motherfucking behind because you too fucking dick dumb and all you worried about is a nigga. See, I didn't get raised like that. See, I was raised around women that go to fuck the work, child. See, goddamn it, child. I don't know what's wrong with you hoes. I, goddamn it, that's what I was telling my auntie the other day. I was telling my auntie the other day because, at, like, I, I, I'm confused. I'm confused because I watch my auntie. These are real women, right? And I watch these women go to work. They weren't sitting around crying over no nigga. Yeah, they love them. God damn it, they'll treat them like, like a king. But they not sitting around crying over no nigga. They not sitting around gossiping about their friends. They not sitting around thinking they better than a motherfucker. 
So what's going on is I wasn't raised like that. God damn it. Hell, motherfucker, yeah. That's why motherfuckers don't like me now. Because I'm loud like my Auntie Donna, Chad. And I don't take no shit like my Auntie Doors, Chad. But I'm real sweet like my Auntie Joy's, motherfucker. But I keep it real raw and uncut. Just like my goddamn grandma. And what's going on is, God damn it, I'm real quiet like my Auntie Ray Ray. So what's going on is, God damn it, and I don't take no shit like my motherfucking Uncle Gary, bitch. That's when that shit come out, my motherfucking ass. When Uncle Gary hit the scene, it's over with. God damn it, go hang. Because, God damn it, it's there. It's there. And it's not coming down. I'm up, bitch. So what's going on is, God damn it, I'm kind of discombobulated because I grew up around real true women, God damn it. I'm talking about real women. My auntie Felicia, she own her own business. I mean, her own buildings, Chad. She own it property around this motherfucker. See, I grew up around women that got their own independent shit. They not worried about nobody else shit because they too busy making money. They too busy worried about their own shit, building their own shit, and not asking nobody for a fucking dollar. What's going on is, goddamn it, you lazy ass motherfucking bitches sat around and gossip and talk shit about me, but uh-uh, I'm next up in line, motherfucker. My people raised a motherfucking queen, child. So why you be voodoo bitches and sitting around waiting on that nigga to get your ass some money? You gotta cipher his energy. You gotta use him and trap him out his motherfucking kids. I ain't gotta do that. I ain't got to do that. So this is the reason why I'm a big ass threat. Why? Because these voodoo ass bitches that motherfucking made these niggas cater to these hoes. And now everybody is waking up to who the fuck they really are. You woke up and you realized that you was with a demonic ass bitch. Uh-huh. Yo, she ran all your hoes away. She ran all your hoes away. That's what Jezebel bitches do. They controlling and they run your hoes away. They block you. That's what these hoes are there for. So you niggas thinking y'all doing something because y'all stayed tied down to a bitch for 30 fucking years. Yeah, that's a devil. She was meant to tie your dumb ass down and take the drain the best years of your life. Yeah, uh-huh. It started early, don't it? Uh-huh. She drained the best years of your life, goddammit. And now you ain't got enough energy to fight. So now you gave up on your goddamn dream just to motherfucking fit her fucking dream. That's what voodoo bitches do. Goddammit, they siphon your energy. They make you take care of their motherfucking ass. So now you niggas thought y'all was doing some shit because y'all ass stayed tied down to a little demonic ass bitch. But y'all not understanding, goddammit. Because at the end of the day, when real women hit the scene such as myself, we not putting up with your baby mama. We not putting up with that toxic ass shit. If you got a toxic ass bitch, a toxic ex, did she thinking she want to stop the nigga? Guess what real women going to do? We not going to put up with it. We'll let you be with the toxic hoe. So I just, I don't, I, y'all niggas is going to miss out on real women that can hold their own weight and that ain't got time for all that low vibrational ass shit. See, that's low vibrational. We ain't got time to be arguing with no hoes. We ain't got time to be arguing with no exes. They're supposed to be in a, we ain't got time for none of that shit. So what be going on is y'all niggas gonna fuck up because your ex's job is to stay there and goddamn it and make sure that you are delayed from your path, from your mission. So a lot of times these niggas is losing their motherfucking life out the goddamn garden because they got Eve manipulating their motherfucking ass. Biting a fucking apple under a curse of fucking death, and they wondering why they can't motherfucking make it and get to where the fuck they at. And goddamn it, they need that bitch. They gotta stay with that bitch. They gotta be dependent on that bitch. Uh uh. Your real woman gonna say, you know what? I don't give a fuck. You got your own goddamn house, nigga. You got your house. I got my goddamn house, motherfucker. And we're gonna be at each other's shit. Yes, because you need your own fucking space, because you are your own individual motherfucker. See, y'all bitches ain't never had a real man like that. No, see, 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 I see, I'm sorry. I, I see, I'm so, I'm so high vibrational child. I'm talking to men, they got their own business, their own motherfucking career. They don't need a bitch. They not even fucking stressed out about a bitch because they too busy making money. I'm talking about they doing semen retention. They, I'm talking about they got discipline on the dick. What's going on is, goddamn it, your niggas ain't got no discipline on a dick, and y'all ain't leaving no mystery to us. So now we don't want that dick, especially if we seen everybody had that motherfucker. Oh, child, we wanna, we don't wanna be seen in the picture with your motherfucking ass after your ass been seen with everybody else. Oh hell, fucking all, who you think this is? Child, we don't want to be seen with these niggas, child. These niggas is out here fucking on all these little low vibrational ass bitches. And they thought that they was doing something. But no, no, no. How is you fucking on all them hoes and you still stuck in standing? The bitches is supposed to make you create. So if you got 10 bitches and you still broke, something wrong with you and something wrong with these hoes. Because at the end of the day, you're supposed to create off that wound. So that lets you know that these hoes got your ass trapped. Because God, no, ain't nowhere in hell you niggas is fucking on 10 hoes and y'all ain't coming up with nothing. The bitches is supposed to come up with something. That wound that you're fucking on. So what's the purpose of y'all fucking? Child, 
the whole purpose of you fucking is for you to create. But if you fucking ten hoes and you still broke, I mean, you fucking a whole bunch of broke ass bitches to me. It seems like you ain't getting no transactions. It seems like every time you go to the ATM, the bitch ain't coming out with nothing. She's broke. It says decline, motherfucker. Your motherfucking insufficient funds. So what's going on is these niggas is fucking on 10 holes, 10 of the insufficient fun holes that ain't got shit in their fucking treasure box. And then they get mad and goddamn it, why? Because goddamn it, you realize that you wasted too much time with all these karmic ass bitches because these hoes ain't leading you nowhere to, but, but to fucking hell. Because goddamn it, you missing your creation window. So now, goddamn it, the niggas thinking y'all doing something because now you didn't settle down. Oh, because that's my baby mama. Well, God ain't tell you to have a baby with the bitch no goddamn way. Jazz, the bitch is a Jazzabelle. She is only there to make sure to make sure you don't make it to where you' supposed to be. So y'all niggas be thinking y'all doing something and goddamn it slaving after a bitch, but goddamn it better be the right bitch. It better be a woman of God, child. Cause what's gonna happen is goddamn it, you gonna slave after a damn Jazzabelle, and what's gonna happen is goddamn it, you will never make it to where you' supposed to be. Cause goddamn it, you over here taking care of some goddamn kids. God never even told you to have with a fucking Jazzabelle. But that's her job. Her job is to stay there and drain you for everything you fucking got and make sure that you never make it so sometimes y'all niggas be falling in love with these hoes Child! and that's the hoe that's meant to block you so yes yeah, she's gonna tell you i want you back yeah you gonna miss that little motherfucker pussy because goddamn it that little demon them demons show sure know how to fuck too Chad. so goddamn it, yeah you gonna miss it but what's gonna happen is goddamn it, you gonna miss the creation window too you gonna miss your mark too fucking around with these damn jazz bills guy Child. So goddamn, these little voodoo ass bitches, they been putting spells after spells on my motherfucking ass, y'all. I'm talking about really trying to get rid of me. Goddamn it, they don't like me because goddamn it, I'm too raw and uncut for these motherfucking bitches. I keep it just too motherfucking real for these hoes. They don't like that. These hoes love talking shit. These hoes love gossiping. These hoes love putting their money in somebody's face. These hoes thinking they doing something, but these hoes ain't shit but fucking hoes. Child. Oh, hell fucking out, child. Oh, hell motherfucking out. And I kept telling them who the ass bitches. I said, y'all gonna get y'all motherfucking ass. Child, y'all gonna get y'all motherfucking day. You know why? Because, y'all, let me tell y'all this. The T is, we coming into the new world order, y'all. And our job is to dismantle all the motherfucking bullshit and chaos on the planet. It's been a battle between good versus evil, y'all. I'm trying to tell y'all, this is the reason why everybody right now is facing karma. Yeah, that everybody facing karma and got an answer to what they did. We don't give a fuck about nothing else. We only give a fuck about what the fuck you been doing. So what's going on is you have to stay, you have to stay balanced. This is the reason why you got to always repent. Yes, Chad, because you're seeing every fucking day. Why? You got to stay fucking balanced. What's going on is these motherfuckers be sinning. They do a whole lot of sinning, y'all. But they not, they not, they not repenting. They not doing shit. So let me tell y'all the thing. The T is, these demonic ass motherfuckers, these voodoo ass bitches been doing spell work and they just, like I said, we been under a curse, right? These bitches been doing spells for so fucking long, for many motherfucking years, they just never got caught with the shit, y'all. I'm trying to tell y'all, these motherfuckers just never got caught, but now they starting to get caught. Why? Because God is taking over. We finna reign for a thousand goddamn years, and goddamn it, these motherfuckers ain't finna make it in 2025. Hell fucking no. God damn it, it ain't finna be that toxic shit going on. The earth need balance. It's already been full of chaos. And God damn it, and, and God damn it, anytime, and this is the reason why we came down here. We are light beings. Light bring orders. God damn it, it's nothing but chaos. Darkness bring chaos. It was dark. This earth was full of darkness, Chad. Yes, Chad, this earth full of darkness. And what be going on there, Chad? The darkness be trying to overpower the light. But soon I flick the light on, motherfucker, it's light. So you can't, the dark, I don't give a fuck. The darkness can never overpower the damn light. I don't know why the fuck his damn, he sent his devils my damn way. And as you know, these motherfucking idiots, they will sit back. I'm talking about, they don't realize that they losing everything. They losing their money. They losing their finances. They going broke in other countries, Chad, trying to do spells on me. You see what I'm saying? These motherfuckers fucked up their own life trying to steal somebody else's life. Trying to steal somebody else's destiny. Trying to cipher my energy when my energy ain't up for fucking sale, motherfucker. I didn't sell out, bitch. What's going on is you motherfucking idiots then really sat back 
and thought something was going to happen to me because you want something to happen to me so bad and y'all didn't realize that the most shit you wish happened to me is going to happen right before your fucking ass to your dumb ass. Now these fools looking like a fool telling me some, why is it happening to me and not her? Bitch, it's happening to you because you over here looking at me wishing bad shit happened to me. So you don't think that everything that you wished upon me is going to happen to you? Y'all didn't think that far? You fucking idiot. Child, these voodoo ass bitches don't fucking think. They think that they could just sit around doing spell work, thinking it's funny. They think they could gang stop other people. But what be going on is when they get exposed, because the devil do not like the the devil do not like the light. He only like darkness. This is why they do shit behind people back. They only like sneaky shit. So then when they get exposed, and goddamn it, now they ego get in the way. And they looking like a damn fool. What? Because they didn't work so fucking hard trying to steal your life. They didn't want nobody to know that they was trying to steal your life. So this is the reason why, another reason why they do black magic. Because they don't want nobody to know that they ass out here doing spell work because they lazy as fuck. And they want somebody else destiny. These little fucking idiots thought that they was going to steal my life purpose. To the point where now they was trying to block my life purpose, Chad. But I just want them fools to understand y'all slow. Because at the end of the day... Where are you going with this? You just watched me elevate, you dumb bitch. See, that's what I'm saying. They work so hard to set me up. You got motherfucking family setting me up. You got motherfucking goddamn it, people that you thought that was your goddamn friends. What's going on? It's my light, y'all. I had to realize that shit like, what the fuck is going on? It's my light, y'all. It's my light and my potential that everybody know I had, but it's like these devils, it's like a zombie apocalypse. I don't know if these motherfuckers, you would think all of them working together, but what be going on is they just all got that devil spirit. They all got that devil spirit and they all attracted to my light. And it's like something be telling them, kill her, kill her. And these dumb motherfuckers get possessed. It's like they get possessed by the goddamn devil. And that's when you know they be doing a whole lot of demonic ass shit. And you be like, what the fuck is going on? Child, it's the voodoo bitches. It's the goddamn voodoo bitches. Goddamn it, these little motherfuckers been putting magic over every fucking body. Goddamn it, for years and years and years. And they just thought that we'll never fucking find out. I told motherfuckers that they didn't raise the frequency up, y'all. They raised our frequency up, Chad. And goddamn it, this is the reason why they taught us English and some old shit, Chad. These motherfuckers been doing magic on our motherfucking ass, but you motherfuckers don't believe that you a magical being. Okay, well, goddamn it, don't believe the shit then. We don't give a fuck, because what's going on is, motherfucker, your motherfuckers getting left behind anyway. Yes, Chad, this is the second coming of goddamn Christ, goddamn it. Everybody, the truth is being revealed. So, goddamn it, God is not going to force you to do shit. He putting the truth out there, so that way it won't be no excuses. Because come 2020, 24, you motherfuckers gonna have to motherfucking all the knowledge your granny taught you. Yeah, child. It's time to motherfucking put it to the test, bitch. Yes, child. Yeah, damn it. It's time to motherfucking rep your shit. Child. These motherfuckers gonna lead their family right to fucking hell. These motherfuckers gonna lead their family right to hell. Why? Because they don't want to open their fucking mind. Yes, child. It's all about the truth. It's all about opening your mind, different perspectives, seeing what life is all about, elevating. Yes, and not being stuck and stagnant. You motherfuckers love staying stuck on earth. This is the reason why you motherfuckers don't like to die. Nah, death is a graduation. Death means, goddamn it, you're, going, you're being more purified, right with God, because, goddamn it, the wages of sin is death. So everybody has to face it, right? You fucking idiot. What's going on is, goddamn, you better hope you have a nice long little life. Cause this thing like you little devils is leaving too motherfucking soon, child. And goddamn it, and you looking like a damn fucking fool. Cause you didn't do shit with your damn life. You didn't mark your goddamn history here, bitch. So child, what be going on there, child? Let me tell you the tea. The tea is these devils that work real hard. It's like they ass following a damn some a deck some in they damn head. Cause they all be like, kill her. Kill her. Get her. And I'll be looking at these fucking things. And I'll be like, oh, that's because I'm breaking generational curses. Yes. Everybody got a Messiah in their family. So sometimes the Messiahs in your family is the ones that everybody say that that's a devil. Yes, child. So I'm breaking generational curses around this bitch. And I got all the devils and the voodoo bitches mad. God damn it, because they can't kill me. And they don't understand that all that devil ass shit is being destroyed off the fucking planet. And God damn it, it's going to be 2024. 
Yeah, all that motherfucking shit is no more. Yes, Chad. So these motherfuckers is pissed off, y'all, because I've been 20 steps ahead of the damn devil while this motherfucker been trying to kill me every moon cycle. They don't understand. This what's been going on. They've been putting up everybody up under the goddamn spell. The celebrities too. So now I got the celebrities looking bad, y'all. Why? Because these motherfucking fools said that we had to kill people. And goddamn it, we got to motherfucking to make it to the top. We got to sacrifice our family members. We got to motherfucking kill motherfuckers. No the fuck we don't. All we got to do is go our ass in the goddamn house and listen to that voice inside of our own goddamn brain and they're going to tell you everything because that's God inside of your motherfucking ass because you got to go inside, not out, motherfucker. Y'all be looking outside. No, you got to go inside and when you go inside, God will tell you, uh-huh, cut that motherfucker off. That motherfucker going to set you up. Cut this nigga off. It's all about the gift of discernment. So when you chosen and you mastering your craft, God will give you power and bodyguards and every fucking thing. How I know? Cause goddamn it, I got the bad bodyguards right now. I'm trying to tell you, these devils been trying to kill me for the last two years, Chad. They don't want me to reach my fullest potential because they understand that I got a lot of power. They understand that I inspire a lot of people and this is something that goddamn it, they don't want. They didn't understand. See, they didn't know. They didn't know that God was using me as bait. I told these fucking fools. God was using me as bait. So that way, goddamn it, these motherfuckers gonna judge me on the outside, but they didn't understand that God is in the inside of me. So goddamn it, God be using me as bait so these motherfuckers could judge me so that way he could bring karma to these motherfuckers because I'm walking karma. Yes, child, my moon sign is Libra, child. I'm a walking karma around this motherfucker. And I'm very intuitive because I'm a sun Pisces motherfucker. Ain't I'm something. No wonder God be using me. Yeah, damn it, because my stars, the stars lines up with me. Yes, child, the stars lines up. I'm chosen, motherfucker. I've been chosen. My motherfucking birth chart is a motherfucking amazing. You new generation motherfucking bitches ain't got the energy that I got inside of my birth chart. I got that potent energy. You motherfuckers ain't got it because you motherfuckers got all that chemtrails in the goddamn air, all that shit. That's when you was born. I was born around the time I had the potent energy inside of me, motherfucker. So you bitches on the planet ain't got this energy. I know you don't because I've been working hard on my goddamn energy while you hoes was outside 40 years old in a club looking for love from all these niggas while I was in the house getting my energy together so that way I can heal myself. You don't know that your body is a natural healer? Yes, Chad. That's why I try to tell you motherfucking devils, goddamn These devils been trying to wish sickness on me and every fucking thing, child. But they didn't understand that I know how to heal myself. Y'all don't know that uh, anything that's on this planet, it can't not kill you. Disease is nothing. Nothing can fucking kill you on this planet because it's man-made. Your body is a physical manifestation of the cosmos, which means, goddamn it, your body has natural abilities that it can heal itself from anything that's on this planet. Child, they use your body, your, your motherfucking show, your body parts, all type of shit inside of medicine. They use your body inside of motherfucking makeup. You bring the beauty, you bring the healing. What's going on is you just don't know how to heal yourself because you don't know how to put yourself in alignment to heal yourself. What's going on is this is the reason why they mad at me. Why? Because I know how to heal myself just like Dr. Sabin. What Dr. Sabin was doing? Going around healing motherfuckers from all type of shit, cancer, AIDS and shit. Yeah, yeah, that's so true. You can actually heal yourself with natural remedies. You are a living organism on this planet, which means you are a plant. That you gotta be very, you gotta isolate. Just if you wanna, if you want this plant to grow, which is your ass, which is a living organism, motherfucker, you are that. You gotta, like I say, you gotta put yourself in a balance, even in your cells. Your cells have, goddamn it, what the motherfucker, what they say, like a bite. We talked about this on my YouTube. That's why y'all gotta come to my YouTube, watch the full video of this video on my YouTube, because we talk about a lot of different stuff on my YouTube. When I download, what God be making me talk about and stuff. Well, he was teaching me about, goddamn it, you have your own biorhythm clocks. You got your own ticking clocks inside of you. These little motherfuckers on earth, these motherfuckers gave us alarm clocks to throw us off balance. So that caused sickness too. That goddamn it, you're not waking your body up when it's supposed to wake up and you're not going to sleep when it's supposed to go to sleep. You ain't supposed to goddamn it. No, no, you're not supposed to get disturbed about your sleep. Not bad, no alarm clock, nothing. You're supposed to go to sleep and wake up when your body say wake up. Not goddamn it, go to sleep and goddamn it, or wake up when an alarm is supposed to wake you up. No, you have your own biorhythm clock. You're supposed to move to your own ticking time. Just like every living cell got its own time. They know when you when you was born, you know when you gonna die. That's your birthday say it all. That's why they always ask you, when the day of birth? 
What's your date of birth? Because they know what generation. They know if you gen, generational Z. They know if you baby boomers. They know all that shit by your date of birth. And by your date of birth, they know when you're going to die. Even when you put it in a geometria with the Illuminati and shit, they know when all the motherfucking rappers going to die, god damn it. Why? Because they date of birth, they name and everything, when you put it in there, it said for itself. Why? Because I'm trying to tell y'all, that... The English letters ain't real in the fucking first place. They taught you English to cast spells on motherfuckers. It's bad numbers. Nine tones of creation. God damn it. Sound waves. I'm trying to tell y'all little hints about what the fuck is going on. What's going on is you need to know fucking science. You need to know some fucking history a little bit. And you need to put all that shit together so you can put the law down. What's going on is, goddamn it, these demonic ass fools put a lot of sound waves out here. They disturb your peace. So what's going on is your job, goddamn. That's why I tell you, motherfucking devils all the time. I ain't got that much time to be wasted, motherfucker, on you, motherfucking idiots. I'm too busy fighting the devil in the air. I'm too busy fighting the devil, goddamn it, in the food. I'm too busy fighting the goddamn devil every fucking where I go to the point where, motherfucker, you not that goddamn important. And this is why God tell you, motherfuckers, your battle is not with the fucking people in the flesh. Your battle is with the demonic forces. You fucking idiots. Y'all don't read your Bible. Y'all don't read your Bible. That's why I don't give a fuck about you. Goddamn it, if you not talking that God talk, what the fuck is you talking about? These motherfuckers ain't talking about shit. If you not trying to come from up under that spell, what is you talking about? Child. I'm done. I'm done. Mm-mm. 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 I gotta watch out, y'all. Mm-mm. What's going on is, what's going on is, people is really paying a price for their bullshit. And they just don't want to. I done had so many people coming against me, attacking me, because they feel like what I'm doing, which is goddamn, I ain't doing nothing to them, but it's like a demon inside they motherfucking ass. It's like, like I say, when you are at a low vibration, the demon can use y'all. The demon, I, just like God can use you, the demon can use you too. Hijack your goddamn body. Y'all motherfuckers looking like a damn fool because y'all let the devil use y'all ass. You fucking idiots. So, I'm trying to tell y'all the T, T is. Hold on. I'm trying to tell y'all the motherfucking T. The T is. You gotta watch out, y'all. You gotta really, really watch the fuck out, Chad. Mm -hmm. You really, really do. Because what be going on is, let me tell y'all, what be going on is, you really gotta watch out for us. Like I say. Hold on, y'all. By these damn groups, by these motherfucking spiritualists and all these groups, these demonic ass groups, they been attacking me, y'all, with spell work. I'm real. I'm talking about really trying to kill me type shit. 
to the point where because because the stuff that I'm saying on my platforms, it got to be the truth because why is they all ganging up on me feeling some type of way? They feeling some type of way, acting like I did something to them because I'm warning people about spell work. See, the thing is, God put me in this situation because a lot of people, like I say, I'm a Pisces, so I like exploring, deep diving into shit. And when I deep dive into shit, I realized that a lot of people have been doing spills on people. A lot of people have been um, manipulating people, at, even at their life, killing people off spills. And people could say I'm crazy. People could say whatever the fuck they want to say. But why would people try to come after me and kill me if what I'm saying on my platform is a lie? If it was a lie, they wouldn't give a fuck about me. I'd be just like Hassan Campbell, all on this bitch, all discombobulated. I fucked with Hassan Campbell at first. But the way he acting right now, I fucked with him at first as far as his story. You know what I'm saying? Because like I say, as a man, for him to come out and say some shit like that, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? I fuck with that. But what's going on right now, these niggas out here chow, cloud chasing, y'all. These niggas be out here cloud chasing, y'all. And what's going on right now, it's like you look at him, you be like, man, bro, you let these demons get you. You let these demons get you. Now your story not even valid no more. Yeah, that happened to you as a child. But like other people said, is you going to help other people? Is you going to warn people? Like, like I mean, by, this, by people trying to do spell work on me, you see how I'm using my platform? I'm warning other people about spell work, black magic. I would never sit around and do the shit on somebody else. Oh, no. I'm trying to teach people how not to turn to black magic and goddamn it and use their platform for righteous so that way god won't take it away from you this is the reason why i stand right here god damn it i got all my green check marks i don't got no strikes or flags or none of that shit on my page because i'm a real original creator i don't use other people content so i don't steal other people's stuff i don't copyright other people's stuff no i'm an original creator that get my real downloads not from ai i get downloads from god so yes child whatever god tell me to say that's what i'm going to say you see what I'm saying? So what be going on is, y'all, let me tell you, see, the T is these devils have been really manipulating the energy. These devils really have been really using people and manipulating people for their gain. This is what I mean by Hassan Campbell. Yeah, that happened to you, and it probably did happen to you as a child. But what are you going to do to change that? See, you're supposed to bring solutions, you see what I'm saying? Anytime a person keeping you confused, anytime a person keeping you stuck and stagnant, every time you drink, motherfucker, you can't put the bottle down. If the, if the drinking would make you act like that, it would make demons come against you and make you go like that, then that means you shouldn't be drinking, bro. You see what I'm saying? I don't even drink. You know why? Because when you high vibrational, you really don't have to drink. But when you have vibrational, um, you understand a little bit more like demons is really... That's the devil's piss, really, drink, you know what I'm saying? So these demons, if, if, if this is something that's going to make me act out of character, I don't want it. But like I said, I can't put that, I can't put what I feel on nobody else, you know what I'm saying? So my job is to always present myself in a way where I want to be represented. You feel what I'm saying? So what be going on is here? Hassan Campbell ass acting a damn fool. Why? Because he not under he not getting over that emotion. He's not dealing with that childhood trauma. So you will end up like that. And that's what the devil wants. So now ain't nobody gonna mess with you. You gonna get black TVs and all. Because now black gonna get money off you. Why? Because you don't know how to deal with your childhood trauma. Child. And when you don't know how to deal with your childhood drama and people and, and the devil wants you to stay stuck and stagnant, guess what he gonna do? He gonna have you famous, famous. You gonna be one of them kids, them men, that so-called made it out the hood, so-called got shot in the hood, whatever, because you got molested. So, but what about the other people? I, child. So what you gonna do to help the other little children that's been molested too? Is you gonna help them or you gonna want them out there drunk, getting shot in the hood? It just seemed like too much acting shit going on. 
And ain't nobody trying to stay stuck and stagnant. Nigga, you went back to the hood. I thought if we, I thought when we make it out, don't go back. Child, this fool went back to the damn hood. That's what happened when you look back and you been turned into a pillar of salt, motherfucker. Because your ass looking back. Child. Mm-mm. Y'all gotta watch out for this. Because what's going on is these people ain't helping nobody. They're not helping nobody for real. It's like they want people to be in a, in a spirit of confusion. And anytime you have a spirit of confusion, that's not a God. God is not about confusion. God is about truth. And he will end up um, bringing you he will bring you understanding. Anytime you have confusion, that's not of God. That's not God's spirit. So, a lot of times people got it wrong. And what's going on is God is showing himself right now in everybody. And this is the reason why we're going through the signs and wonders. God tell you about the signs and wonders. Right? Hold on, y'all. Let me put this thing up. This is the reason why God tells you about signs and wonders. Because I'm trying to see, do I want this one? Or do I want another? But yeah, this is the reason why God tells you about signs and wonders. Because I'll use this. This is the reason why God tells you about signs and wonders. Because you gotta pay attention to the signs, y'all. You gotta pay attention to the signs. What's going on is these devils can't live off people's energy no more. And everybody being exposed to who they really are. The truth is coming out. So what people been doing behind closed doors. The you can't be naked no more. You know how when that damn it Adam ate that damn apple and he was naked right before God. It's like, I mean, when I say you can't be naked, no, you can't hide no more, y'all. What I'm trying to say is, it's like you're going to be naked right before God. You see what I'm saying? Because God going to see everything. You're going to be thinking you're trying to have, but now, nah, motherfucker, you're going to be right there naked. We see your motherfucking ass. And what's going on is a lot of people have been doing some fucked up ass shit, y'all. Doing a lot of voodoo. Doing a lot of spell work. And they ain't telling nobody. But this is why the Queen Marie show, y'all got me coming out. And I, I is just now. Why? Because I reveal shit that people don't want to talk about in the public. You see what I'm saying? I, I reveal shit that, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I, I, I deal with them demons for real, for real. I get to the root of the problem. You see what I'm saying? And a lot of times people not ready for that. You know, people not ready for that type of truth. You see what I'm saying? So, what's going on is, these motherfuckers think they got enough time. They got more time. God said you're running out of time. That's why I got the time is speeding up, motherfucker. Because he is here already. It's over. But these devils be feeling like, oh, I'm going to try one last time. I'm going to do one more spell. I'm going to get it this time. It is over, bitch. So they've been trying to shut me up for the past two years. Now I see why. Because I've been revealing shit. They goddamn it. And bringing shit. And it's like it's like a goddamn, what you call that? Predicting shit. Like God been really been using me. And everything that I've been saying, this is why the devil, this is why the devil mad at me because he can't deny. He wanted to deny me so bad, but he can't deny my gifts. And I'm doing something that ain't nobody doing. I'm using my spiritual gifts. And I'm getting famous for my spiritual gifts. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, I do music and shit too. But nah, motherfuckers like the way I talk. You see what I'm saying? They love my brain. Yeah, that is why they want to kill my motherfucking ass. But they can't kill me because they know that I'm one of the chosen ones. So, you know what I'm saying? So, the only thing they could do is try to put spell work on me, try to motherfucker make me give up on myself, or try to make me give up and say, okay, I'm going to kill myself. Well, all this dumb ass shit, this is what these devils do because they understand that they cannot kill me because God say, do not touch my anointing. These motherfuckers are dad before me, and they know if they ever came my way, they kids will die, they ass will die. It'll be a lot of, it'll be a whole fucking raging war going on. So, these motherfuckers understand 
goddammit, okay, it's best that I just throw the spell work on her and sit back and watch. So these motherfuckers been throwing spell work on me, sitting back, watch, trying to see if I'm going to break. But they not understanding that all spell work basically makes me transmute the fucking energy, you dumb, retarded motherfucker. And it actually makes motherfucker make me grow bigger legs. So now I'm even stronger than what I was yesterday because the devil didn't decide to put some spell work on me and God been changing my energy every fucking day to the point where every time a spell hit me, I elevate. Every time a spell hit me, I elevate to the point where these bitches better stop doing spell work because all you're doing is helping me elevate, you dumb, retarded motherfuckers. They don't like me elevating, but they only, they, they helping me elevate by doing spell work. They dumb ass. They, cause they really think, and they, if they believe in God, how they believe in spell work, they'll be fine. But these motherfucking evil motherfuckers, they be feeling like, one day I'ma get them. One day I'ma get them. And every day God gonna make them watch me elevate. I don't know what, like, I don't know if they gonna get that part. I don't fucking know, but every day these demonic motherfuckers be like, I'ma get her ass, I'ma get her ass, but they not understanding. Every time they even think that, every time they even say that, every time they even think bad on my name, God gonna make me elevate. God gonna make me elevate. God gonna, and then they gonna realize that they been spending the last two years putting spell work, going broke, goddamn it, doing spell work. I'm talking about, they gotta sit back and watch me though. They gotta do the spell, then they gotta sit back and watch. Y'all might as well wait on God for that. They don't want to wait on God. They want to do evil shit. So they do spell work on me, y'all. And they sit back and see if I'm fucked up or if I'm goddamn it, and I'm going to break or burn out. But they not understand it. Every time they throw a spell, God elevates me even more higher than what I was yesterday. So you demons ain't doing nothing but helping me evolve, you fucking dumb idiot. Fucking idiot spells ain't nothing but fuel to my fire to help me transmute energy. I be wanting y'all to put a spell on me so I can do another song. That's all the time. I'm trying to tell these fucking idiots. That's all the time, goddamn it. I'm trying to tell y'all. Y'all the motherfuckers give me the fire. And when y'all give me the fire, I transmute the energy and I go write a song on you bitches. I put it in my creativity. Something that God told us to do. So now you motherfuckers looking like an even more dumbass fool. Because y'all be like, damn, I was setting this motherfucking motherfucking problem up so that way god damn it we could destroy her but the problem i transmuted that problem and so and i used that motherfucking energy that y'all gave me y'all motherfuckers give me y'all energy every day these motherfucking idiots they thought that they was doing something but now no you don't know how powerful i am bitch i take your energy the negative energy you throw my way it would never work because i know how to take that shit and transmute it motherfuckers how you think y'all making me a boss because I know how to transmute the energy and now I put it in my creativity and I make a hit, I make a laugh, I do something with your negative energy. You fucking idiots. So y'all slow if y'all really thought that your spell work was going to work. It doesn't matter what death spells, whatever the fuck spell you throw my way, I'm going to take the energy and I'm going to use it. You fucking idiot. This is why I stay balanced. This is why I stay cleansing myself. Why? Because when that energy come my way, I know when it comes because I know my energy. So I know when it comes and I get that motherfucker and I use it and butch, I write a fucking hit on these motherfuckers. God damn it. Who the fuck a broke bitch acting like a broke bitch? These bitches sad. Why the fuck a broke bitch acting like a rich bitch? You see what I'm saying? That's because a bitch put a spell on them. That's because a bitch tried to put a fucking fuck. Tried to set me up, but she didn't understand. I knew how that little negative energy she was throwing my motherfucking way. Boom, I transmuted that bitch. Boom, made a hit off that hoe. Now this bitch gonna play my motherfucking song, but she understand that that song was meant for you, bitch. You let the nigga home, fuck her nigga on the side. Dead pussy bitches, bitches really came up that. See what I'm saying? See what I'm saying? You gotta learn how to put that shit.